Hello everybody, my name is Alberto Quero and I am an exiled artist. I come from what is left of Venezuela. Just like six million other people also did, I escaped from the communist regime that has been ruling my country since 1998. I studied at the University of Zulia. I hold a bachelor in linguistics and literature, a master's degree in literature and a doctorate in humanities. But all of that is almost meaningless when you're out of your homeland. When you're fighting for your life, academic accomplishments don't matter much. So far, I have published six books of short stories and two books of poetry in Spanish, my mother tongue. I have also published many academic papers in peer-reviewed journals. I specialize in literature semiotics. In Canada, I discovered the art of slam, which I practice every now and then. I have also had the chance to publish some poems written in English and in French. One of those poems is called Exile, and it appeared here in this magazine, the first issue of The Other Side of Hope. I am going to read it right away, and it goes like this. At the end, one ends up belonging to no land. One is a visitor everywhere, and home has been left behind. And no, it is neither the same sun nor the same seas, and the wind does not sound likewise when it blows among the trees. And the memory of the elders will differ elsewhere, just as children's laughter also will. And neither joys nor sorrows will ever be the same if the soil varies. And it looks like it was hard to walk on it just because one is not from that place. Or like memories were bolts and chains that added way to the march. And roads seem to be longer, endless, invisible, because they are the destination itself and every tree, every trip is an escape. The heart knows it is a visitor and the soul knows it is a foreigner. Those who flee end up belonging to no land, to absolutely none at all. Thank you very much.